Hey, what's going on guys? We Flatten here with a brand new video today. Today we're going to be going over the fastest Seraph and Iridium farm in the Tiny Tina's one-shot adventure. So what you're going to do is once you're inside Wing Storm, the very beginning, you're going to go all the way down to this area over here. The reason why this ends up being the fastest and most efficient if you can't beat the dragon solo is if you don't have friends like me, maybe the dragons are just not a plausible fight for you. So, once you're in this arena over here, you're gonna want to go ahead and go to this little altar over here. You'll know it's the right area once you see the fire and, like, this altar. Um, there's a little rock that sticks out here. You jump. You jump on over. This rock kind of sticks out over here, and then you jump to the bridge. Now you've technically made it into the treasure room. All of the chests are not gonna be available to you, unfortunately, because you have to beat the dragons in order to make them, um, work. But, um, that's okay. We don't need those. So you're gonna go up those stairs and down these ones. Make it a little faster. You can jump off the edge here. All the way down to this little bridge. And now you're in the Mimic treasure room. Now, every single Mimic, or every single chest here, sorry, uh, is rigged to be a Mimic every single time. It's not a chance. It's always a 100% guarantee. You open up uh, all the chests, the Mimics will spawn. You kill the Mimics, you get Seraph Crystals, you get Iridium. Uh, you'll probably get about minimum 40, like max 55-ish. Uh, you go ahead and save quit and you can just redo it. Uh, you don't have to fight the dragons at all, and uh, it'll allow you to reset. Just to prove it. Mimics are in here, they drop a bunch of Seraph Crystals, a bunch of Iridium. Super easy kills too, uh, especially if you do it on normal mode. Everything will be a mimic. And there's that. In order to reach this part here, though, you have to make sure that you beat the DLC first. Uh, and you need to get a mission off of Torg called Raiders of the Last Boss. The only way to get this mission is if you complete the uh, side quest off of Torg Fake Geek Guy. It is a chain quest, so you finish that one first. And then he'll give you Raiders of the Last Boss. You go all the way into the... Um, oh, what is the area named now? It's the uh, Lair of Infinite Agony. From there, you go into the Wingstorm, and then you just follow this pathway that I just uh, showed you to get here. Happy Iridium farming, happy Seraph Crystal farming. Spend it all on um, the Ludipults, and uh, hopefully you get some good legendaries out of that. Thank you all so much for watching the video. My name is B Flattened. I'm signing on out of here. Take care all. Uh, laters.